Good morning, YouTube. My name is EB, and today we'll be going over all the requests in the Nature Park Nighttime. Best Frenemies. For this one, we're going to move on to this area by the bend here. Once you're here, you should see a dirt mound on your left. You're going to scan, and a pincer should pop out. Once he pops his horns out, throw a Lumina Orb at him, and he'll jump out. Once he's landed, you can take a look at the tree here, scan twice, and hair cross should fall out. There you go. Now we're going to move on over to this area by the dam and bridge. Once you're here, you're going to take a look behind this Torterra, and there should be a sleeping Sylveon on the floor. You're going to throw a Lumina Orb at Sylveon, and then he'll wake up and run away. Now we're going to take a look on your right over here. And you're going to see Pinsir and Heracross start fighting. Once they start fighting, you want to throw a Lumina Orb at them, have them lit up. And then play some music, and then they'll stop fighting. And Sylveon will pop out from the back here. If you're having problems getting the request completed, make sure you're taking a picture of Pinsir and all three of them at this moment when they're celebrating. All three must be in the picture. Now you can quit and submit. Arts in Flight. For this one, we're going to move on over to the lake. Once you're by this crystal bloom, you're going to stop turbo boosting and look in the sky. You'll see a couple of swana flying around that are already in Illumina form. You're going to zoom in and take a photo of them. This will cause one to fly off and one to land in the water. Now here, make sure you zoom in to slow you down a little bit. This will help you get a clearer shot between the Torterra. Once the swan lands in the water, you're going to look at it and play some music, and it'll wake up the rest of the flock. Now you want to take a picture of the swan taking off. Do not take a picture of the ducklet, it will not count. If you take a picture here when they're already flying, it will again not count. I you quit and submit. A terrific yawn. So this one could be done anywhere where you find the sleeping Torterra throughout the level. The nearest one's by the lake, so let's skip over there. So once you're here, just start chucking some fluff root at all the Torterra. The problem with this pose is that it's not 100% trigger rate. So you'll see that they squint their eyes instead of opening their eyes. Just want to keep chucking it every time their eyes completely close until one of them opens their eyes completely. There you go. Once that's done, it's going to do a little yawn and take a picture of that. There you go. Now you can quit and submit. Sleep on a calm night. For this one, we're going to fast forward over to the dam. Once you're here by the dam, you're going to take a look at this Torterra over here. And then there's going to be a Sylveon sleeping right next to it. You're just going to go there, and you're going to take a picture, and then you can quit and submit. Dancing with the Queen. For this one, we're going to move on over to the flower fields. Once you're here, you're going to throw a Lumina Orb at this Crystal Bloom on the right. That'll trigger Combi to go get Vespi Queen. Once they're out, you want to make sure you take a picture of Combi dancing with Vespi Queen in the background. The focus must be on Combi. Should be taking the photo zoomed out, it'll be a lot easier to complete the request. Once Vespi Queen is out and in position, you're going to throw a Illumina Orb at this Crystal Bloom down there and they'll start dancing. There you go. Take a picture and I quit and submit. For whose sake? For this one, we're going to move over to the flower fields. Once you're here, you're going to throw a Lumina Orb at this Crystal Bloom on the right. That'll trigger Combi to go get Vespi Queen. Once Vespi Queen is out, you're going to throw a Lumina Orb at her. And take a picture. Now you can quit and submit. Hard One Happiness. For this one, we're going to take a look on the right over here for Pidgeot. There she is. We're going to throw a Fluff Fruit to make sure she eats it. Keep an eye on her. Sometimes she doesn't need it. Okay, there you go. Now we're going to fast forward over to the lake. Once you're here, you'll see Pidgeot land in this left bush over here. There you go. Now you're going to throw some fluff fruit at her. Keep an eye on her. Make sure she eats it. Sometimes she gets startled by you and doesn't eat the fluff fruit. There you go. She's eating it. Now we're going to move on over to the flower fields. Once you're here, there's no more interaction needed. Pidgeot will fly from the sky in front of you and stop you in your tracks. Now she's going to do a little pose, squatting down. There you go. Take a picture of that. Now you can quit and submit. Hoots Hoots Hidden Foot. For this one, we're going to move on over to the flower field. Once you're here, you should see a Hoot Hoot standing on top of a tree over here. You're going to throw a fluff root at it, and it'll get off balance and reveal its second foot. Take a picture of it revealing its second foot, and you can quit and submit. 
Munching Murkrow. For this one, we're going to move on over to the dam. Once you're here by the dam, you want to make sure that you don't hit the Murkrow and you have a nice distance away from them so they're not scared. You're going to throw a fluff fruit, get their attention, and take a picture of them eating. There you go. Now you can quit and submit. Sudden Movements. This one's going to be done right in the beginning. You're going to take a look at Tangrowth, throw a Lumina Orb at him. Then he's going to jump up and you want to take a picture of the arms outstretched. Now you can quit and submit. Where's that Pokemon? For this one, we're going to move on over to the flower fields. Once you're here, you're going to take a look at the sign on the left, play some music, and you'll see Caterpie pop out. There's going to be four. Take a picture. Now you can quit and submit. Where it snacks, it snoozes. For this one, we're going to go to this area right around the bend. Once you're here, you're going to scan to reveal Pinsir. Throw an Illumina Orb at him so he jumps out. Now you're going to look at this tree and scan twice. And Heracross will fall out. Take a picture of Heracross on the floor. There you go. Now you can quit and submit. Who needs wings? This one's going to be done right in the beginning. You're going to turn to the left and there should be a Dodrio walking around right over here. You're going to take a picture zoomed out. Take a look at him. Throw a Illumina Orb and he'll jump. Or she. Take a picture. Now you can quit and submit. 